it's no secret that Steve Jordan is a legendary drummer in the music world. He has done so much, and we all know him for being that guy that plays such groovy drum grooves that just feel good. They're so nice to listen to. You just want to sit back and just kind of bob your head. So I was kind of browsing through YouTube, watching different Steve Jordan videos, and this one popped up where he was just doing like an interview for Guitar Center, and he was playing a really simplistic beat, but the way he was playing it and the way it sounded was really cool. So we're gonna look at that groove here. The concepts here are quite challenging, but we're gonna have a look at this and I'm gonna explain how to play it and then we're gonna work at it. Cool, so I'm gonna give you a few concepts to kind of think about before playing this groove. Um, you kind of need them before being able to play it. The first one is being able to play 16th notes really comfortably on the hi-hat. If that is a bit of a struggle to play fast 16th notes, this is something you need to work on. The way I think about it that makes it way easier to kind of teach and learn and work on is just to do the molar method, but like the molar method is quite tricky to learn at first. So all you need to think of when it comes to playing the hi-hat is playing the first note on the tip of the hi-hat and the second note on the edge. So if you go tip, edge, tip, edge, tip, edge, you're kind of working on that technique without thinking about it. And you just want to do that kind of to get used to it and then speed it up. And there's your hi-hat technique for playing quick 16th notes. The other thing about this groove is Steve Jordan plays a ghost note just before a backbeat. That can be quite tricky if you haven't played stuff like that before. So just work on that as well. Here's a simple groove working on that idea, playing a 16th note groove and putting ghost notes just before the backbeat. Cool, let's go to the groove now. I will play it slowly, I'll speed it up, and this is an iconic Steve Jordan groove. Here we go. Take it, learn it, play it for your friends. Before I end this video, I just want to show you guys Drumio Edge. Drumio, um, I think we all know Drumio, hugest drum platform in the world. <laughs> they do a lot of teaching, social media stuff, but a lot of people think Drumio is just the YouTube channel or the Instagram page. They actually have a platform called Drumio Edge, which you sign up for and you subscribe to and you pay monthly. This is where the real value of Drumio lies because here you'll find thousands of like high, high quality educational videos to learn literally anything on the drums taught by the best drummers in the world. There's a link in my description of this video where you can sign up for Drumio to get a free 30 day trial. So you get a whole month to kind of check out the platform, see what's on it, see all the valuable stuff. Um, if you like Steve Jordan, 
They've never gotten them on there yet, but there are literally hundreds of videos on how to play grooves, how to feel good while playing grooves, how to make them sound like they feel good. Um, yeah, so click the link in the description of this video, sign up for a free 30 day trial to Drumeo and you will unlock so much stuff to learn. Thanks guys, that's the video for today. I'll see you in the next one.